UConn, fourth straight Big East title. Ice Brady alongside with me. What are the emotions right now? I saw all the embraces with your teammates. Just super proud, like we said, obviously having everybody out that we wish we had earlier in the year, but just like Paige said, finding a way to persevere and just the way we just showed up today and was just so relentless. It says a lot about this team and the characters that are on this team, and I'm so proud of this team, and I don't want to be on any other team, and I feel really great, yep. 80 minutes for you combined between yesterday and today. How are you feeling, and how did you step it up for your team? I mean, obviously I'm a little tired, but um, in the game I didn't feel it at all. Just so locked in, and um, especially having Aaliyah, I wanted to, you know, step up for her and step up for my team, and uh, especially how things were going earlier in the season, just letting, letting them know that they can count on me. Um, and I'm really happy that I was able to do that, and they had that trust in me, and I had 100% trust in them. And, I'm just so thankful and happy to be here. You mentioned Aaliyah Edwards. How much does he mean to this program? Everything. I mean, you see the way the crowd lights up when they show her face on the camera. Obviously, she's a big leader for me when I look at her. Um, just the way she plays, the way she has her heart and everything. And just, yeah, the fact that I was able to step up and, you know, fill that void a little bit, just I was really proud. This team's not done yet. You got March Madness coming up. What kind of statement did the Huskies make throughout this tournament? 
I think it says a lot, you know, the fact that we had six, seven players, something like that. Um, seven and seven. The other other uh, seven were on the bench hurt. Um, and the fact that we still went undefeated and uh, competed the way we did to make sure we got this dub just says a lot, like I said, about the characters. And, um, yeah, we're not done yet. So, Congratulations. Go enjoy it. Thank you. Fourth straight for UConn here at Mohegan Sun. Just mentioned it four straight in a row for for UConn. 22 total in the Big East. What does it mean to get it done on this floor with your teammates? Um, it means everything. Um, we were handed some pretty unusual cards this season, um, but we were relentless in each game. We showed that, and I'm just so proud of us. And with all these young stars on this team, three freshmen, I think it was four or five at the end of this ball game. Mm -hmm. What does that say just about? How, how far this team has come this season and how you guys can trust each other. Um, I'm so proud of us from where we started and where we are now. It's completely different. Like, we have a complete different mentality. And, and I mean, it's just incredible. And, like, we've grown up a lot this season. And uh, it's all due to the guidance of our coaches and um, our seniors with Nika, Paige, and Aaliyah. How much have those three meant to you guys? Absolutely everything. We wouldn't be where we are without them. They're the glue of this team, and we love them so much. Leah Edwards specifically going down with injury. How much did that fuel the squad? Um, it fueled us a lot because Aaliyah is such a great player that we knew that we had a great missing piece that we needed to fill um, for each game, and we weren't gonna and we weren't gonna let that stop us. But I mean, we just stepped up and rose to the occasion. And to do this with Coach Ariema too, I saw you guys trying to get him to dance a little bit with the confetti. How much does he mean in just everyone's progress this season and just sticking to it? He means everything. He runs his team. He's done this like forever, and he just knows greatness, and he is greatness. So, I mean, it's just so cool to be mentored by him, be coached by him, and learn from him. Well, we saw some greatness on the court tonight. Thank you so much for the time. Fourth straight Vicky's champion. Thank you. Sorry. Congratulations. Thank you. Nika Mule joining me now on UConn Plus. I see a lot of emotion. I know it was quite the game for this team and just the resiliency that the squad has shown throughout the entire year. Coach Ariema said that this one was a challenge, four straight, but this one was different. Can you take me through what this team's gone through this year? Oh my God, there's not enough time on TV <laughs> to take you through what, we got, what we've gone through this year, but it wasn't just like a crazy game, it was a crazy season and it's still going on, it's still, you know, it's still alive and it's the most important part of the season but just you know just looking at our bench and looking at who, who we have on the floor and nothing changes for us like right here nothing changes for us our energy is up people believe in us you know every, all the people that came today to watch I mean this is what it's all about and it's so much bigger than basketball and I'm, I'm so proud to be able to call myself you know a Husky. And doing it for Aaliyah Edwards as well you heard the ovation from the crowd what does she mean to this program? I mean, she means everything, and we need we need her back ASAP. We need her back ASAP, and you know, I'm I, masked Lee. If people know from last year, is the best Leah. So you know, everything happens for a reason, and um, I mean, we're playing for our whole bench, man. It's it's and it's unfortunate, but um, it taught us so much, and um, I can't wait to see all of those guys in action too. Yeah, this team's not done yet. Still have March Madness coming up. What kind of statement did this team make? I mean. We've been making statements all year. For the last four years that I was here, I feel like, you know, with injuries and everything going on, all the challenges we've been through, uh, but this is just another statement to ourselves, nobody else, just to ourselves that we can do it with three people on the floor. So I'm so proud of this team and proud of the coaches, proud of everybody on the staff, everybody, you know, that came to watch, everybody that's watching from, from home because they believe in us and that gives us so much energy and belief in us. So. Congratulations, Nika Mule, Big East champion in 2024. Thanks so much for the time. Thank you so much. All right, that'll do it from the Hegan Sun Arena, but we've got one more special guest here. I think Paige Beckers is going to join us with a hat from Gino Ariema. Paige, congratulations. Thank you. Four straight Big, Big East title, but I know this one was special for you. Coming back from injury, all the adversity that you faced, how do you sum up what season this has been? It's been a challenging rewarding season lots of adversity lots of highs and lows but the main thing I can take away is just gratitude um, being so grateful to be playing the game again um, not focusing on what we don't have and focusing on what we do have and going from there playing the hand we were dealt um, taking the blows and just always responding um, I have a I'm a woman of God I have a great faith so that pushes me and that stables me um, just to keep persevering keep going keep going through anything because 
can do anything through Christ. Aaliyah Edwards sitting out, obviously, with injury. How much did she fuel this team, though? I mean, we've been fueled all season by the people who haven't been in uniform just because we want to perform for them and we want to do it for them, for the people that can't play. But to see Aaliyah go down in the first game, it definitely motivated us for the rest of the tournament and having to step up and fill that void. 27 points for you. How do you step up your game when the lights are the brightest for your team? Uh, just try to play my game. Uh, just take what the defense is giving me, but also being very aggressive. Um, I thought I'd try to be aggressive, especially when Aliyah went out after the first game, just looking for my shot, creating for others. I've um, been playing extremely hard with passion, with energy, um, and just have fun playing a game of basketball. Speaking of fun, you and your teammates obviously love each other so much. What does this group specifically mean to you? They mean everything. This is the most resilient group I've ever been around. Um, just the way we band together through anything, um, through all this the stuff that we've been through, the strength that we show, the resilience, um, the perseverance. Um, these guys are my sisters for life, um, and we build memories that are going to last a lifetime, and I'm extremely grateful for them. Congratulations on the win, 2024 Big East champion. Thank you. All right, that'll do it from Mohegan Sun Arena, UConn, your Big East champions in 2024, fourth straight in the Big East. Thanks so much for joining us on UConn Plus. Thank you. Hey, it's full. Hey, her full.